Did, is there a police report from last week? Like, is there anything going on with that? There's Can you look up a, a uh, is there a number? But give me one second, okay? So, yeah, I mean, if, if there's a detective assigned it, then there should be a case number. Yeah, the only issue is we have separate incident numbers for, like, all the different calls associated with him. So give okay. me a moment, okay? Okay, take your time. A few moments later. Okay, are you still there? Yes. Okay, so yeah, we um we actually already had a, uh, it turns out we already had calls in today reference him and issues with him as well. Um, so what my sergeant was saying is, the other thing you'd recommend, there is, you know, investigations and everything going on, but... Say! Say. What? Yo, Zay, what is it? Um, so I caught one that you were having trouble understanding who the Council of Eight are and what they're about. The Council of Eight is a group that Marty, William, Edward Boy, Jay Sims, and a few other people made up to sound badass. They made that name up to try to, basically to try to scare me. There's like more than eight members though. There's several people. There's... I don't know, and there's the Council of Eight, and then there's the... The Sunny of 43, which if you're wondering what 43 is, that is literally their way of marking a prime target. If somebody is a 43, they're on the high-end spectrum of being somebody's target. Let's move! I told these trolls to lick my butt crack, and they, they do a good job licking my butt crack. Bing bong! <laughs> Bing bong! I don't want to go to jail! Oh, and in case I don't see you, good afternoon, good evening, and good night. When the spawn meets This is a certified hood classic. Hey, oh, hey, oh, hey, oh, hey, oh, hey, it's your boy CJ, and we back at it like a crack addict with a bad habit. And today has just been rough. Work has been rough. My neck and my feet are in so much pain. And so once I got off work, I ended up going on YouTube to see some of the new comments I got from my recent video from today, right? And I started seeing comments saying something about an investigation. <laughs> This and that, and I'm like, whoa, 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 what is happening here? But then I told myself, calm down. Lots of people like to scare or troll Cyrax, and they will make up something, and everybody will repeat it, right? Which I find somewhat funny, depending on what it is, right? But... Sheesh, from the few comments i seen, and I responded to a couple of the comments, and they seem legit. Like, the one guy was giving me serial numbers to, like, to an investigation. I, 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 some sort of numbers for something. I'm, I'm regarded when it comes to that since I have no idea what is happening at this very second, okay? So, let's just make this intro quick, and I'm, this is gonna be raw for me. I have not seen this, but let's get right into it. Let's go. Let me bring you up to speed. Okay, and see, we're on this page right here. And all I had to do is type in N-word boy, and the first, it's the second thing that pops up. Okay. Akron police confirm there are active investigations against Chance Wilkins. <laughs> got him. We fucking got him. <laughs> and was this last month? Yeah, I think this could have been last month. I don't know for sure. I forget. Okay, let's, but let's, let's watch his video. Let's get into this, shall we? And like I said, this could be a troll. I have no idea. Let's get into this. 2024, 22 hours, 40 minutes, 24 seconds. Hacker, place of fire, Tech 227. 
Hi, I'm calling. I, I don't think it's, this is an emergency. I'm calling about Chance Wilkins. Okay, and what's going on with Chance Wilkins? Chance was on, this is the second week in a row where he's been on somebody's uh, YouTube channel and got frustrated and stands up and begins masturbating into the camera. Oh, nice. Just another day in the office. Wow, that hasn't happened in a while. Hasn't it? That, I don't remember seeing that in a while. This must be, like, obviously this, maybe this guy is just making something up to get an investig. I don't know. Let's hear it. Sorry. Yeah, last Friday, I, I called and made a report, report last Friday. I went to make a report last Friday. They said there was a detective already on it or whatever, but he just did it again. Okay. Um, what was the address for him? Okay. Okay, and uh, are we able to get your name and number in case I have any questions for you? Is my name and number going to be on a police report? Um, if, so if they request it, yes. Like if, if someone requests it, yeah. beep, beep, it would be on beep, there. Beep, 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 beep. Oh, um. It's up to you. Like, they would have to give us their information. Like, people can't just, you know, go online. <laughs> they have to give what, us here? Here's the thing. I, I have no problem giving you my name and number if something's going to happen. But, like, I called last week, and he's doing it again. It, it, is, what, is that illegal, what he's doing? I, I mean, I, I don't want to keep... I, it is, I would think. I can't guarantee because yeah, I'm I, not a police officer, but I'm both down. I don't want to keep <laughs> bothering you guys with something that's not illegal. Yeah. Um, oh, this guy is being very considerate, very polite, and so I, this guy's cool. <laughs> From what it sounds like. And I wouldn't be giving out my name and number if I put myself in this position. I probably wouldn't, unless it was like a severe situation, then I would, but... Huh, interesting. The second week in a row, he hasn't done anything. Well, yeah, huh? I know. Um, I don't know, it's, uh person that we often have issues with. Give me one second, okay? Hold on. Yes. He got out of that. He didn't give him... Uh, he talked out of that. Very smart. And when, <laughs> you last, when was the last time you reported it? When was the last issue of it? I called last... He did it last Friday night, but I called Saturday because I didn't think it was an emergency. Okay. So I called him the next morning. Okay. Yeah, I didn't want to waste... I don't want to call 911 because I don't want to waste a cop going out there, because, especially if it's not, no one's going to do anything. Yeah. Um, let's see. Oh, and I'd like to say, I was maybe expecting an AI voice from the cop, like somebody trolling, but that sounds. I hear some southern twang in there. If I'm correct, let me know. Very slight, um, but it sounds legit. Please, let me know down below if I'm getting trolled right now myself. Is there a police report from last week? Like, is there anything going on with that? There's Can you look up a, a uh, Is there a number? Uh, I'm trying to see which one's yours. Would you have given... Did you give your phone number when you called last time by chance? No, no. When I called last week, they said that uh, people have already... I, they, the lady was kind of not, not rude, but she said, you know, we've been told about this many times... Uh, there's a detective assigned to it. She never asked me for a number or anything because apparently a bunch of other people called. Yeah, it's probably this then. Not, it, it's not one that you called in to Saturday, but then we did have a call about it. That's what I was kind of looking at. It was that Friday we had a call about it. Um, give me one second, okay? So, Just, yeah, I mean, if, if there's a detective assigned to it, then there should be a case number. Yeah, no, it should have separate incident numbers for like all the different calls associated with them. So give okay. me one. Oh, so they are tying things together. Ladies and gentlemen, we got him. Haha, uh -huh. I don't I think that means something. Am I talking out my ass? That seems like they're keeping a record on him already. No shit, Sherlock! But that might not be, there might be more juicy parts. I haven't seen this. Okay, take your time. Nope. That was sweet. A few minutes later. Okay, are you still there? Yes. Okay, so yeah, we um we actually already had, uh, it turns out we already had calls in today reference him and issues with him as well. Um, so what my sergeant was saying is oh. the other thing you'd recommend, there is, you know, investigations and everything going on, but if this is happening on YouTube... We got him. Boys, we got him. <laughs> <laughs> oh. The thing is, this is just audio, right? Um... 
somebody could be playing this cop. But guys, this it doesn't seem like it. This sounds like an operator, like a, an official operator. It, it, just in my my opinion. But oh wow. Yo, Cyrax is shaking in his boots right now. He's probably zip zip zooming all over the place. <laughs> like the best thing for him, guys. What is it? I can't hear you. Is to get off the internet. So, Cyrax, you could do yourself the biggest favor. Um. Also, he said it'd be a good idea to advise YouTube, like, see if you can contact YouTube, like, maybe like headquarters or whatnot, and advise them so they can at least maybe take down his account uh -huh. right now while they, no, they don't. You know, they don't. No, we've done that. Hundred. I mean, there, there's all there's a whole website okay. set up though. There's five thousand people that have to call YouTube every yeah. day. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Well, we but, do, we definitely did. Um, I actually see him right here. We did have um other multiple other calls today. Reference him as well. Damn. Um. So they have been going by trying to figure things out and and checking on everything. And Yo, show if this is real. Shoutouts to this woman right here. Seriously, a big round of applause both of these guys two round of applause straight up both of these people were respectable they talk shit out he didn't have to say his name or anything like that sneaky sneaky sir that's what happens when you're polite you can get around things very good talker trying to work on it as much as they can okay but they they do have yeah. um all the information but then what mm -hmm. Last week, is there a case number for that? And remember what I was saying about there was like a serial number or something like that I was saying? It was a case number. You're a stupid dumbass. That buddy gave to me in the comments. Incident? Yeah, we're, we're showing that like where someone else called in and said he was uh, exposing himself. Um, yeah, let me... Do you have is that public? Yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I'll give you this info for this um, incident number, and then you can go online to AkronCops.org, and uh, there's a report portal, and you can request it in there. Yep. All right. Okay. It is two four dash oh, six here it is, guys. zero eight eight I'm seven. I'm an idiot. And this okay. is public, two, so four we're good. Dash six zero eight eight seven. Yes, sir. And that's from last week. Um. Yes, that was on. Oh, that's twenty three. All right. Okay. Yeah, I'm sorry that you guys are dealing with it. I know we we do get a lot of calls about him. So where where is no it? no we're sorry that you got to deal with this. Don't worry about us and everybody else. We're sorry about you. This is the first time I'm apologizing to a cop in my life. We're not apologizing, but you know um, what they're I mean. trying to do what they can as, as quick as they can. Okay. Thank you very much. No problem. Have a good night. Okay. Okay. And that sounds amazing. I'm hyped, right? But I just got a feeling in my stomach that it might not be as good as we think. I hate even saying this, but I, I, I got a feeling that, yeah, it might be an investigation, but it's not in what we want it to be. I'm talking on my ass right now. Don't get me wrong, but it just feels like it's too good to be true. But... Is there anything else? You know what? Let's go back to our homeboy N-Word Boys channel and check out something else. Okay, we're gonna watch this last little bit, okay? And uh, we're gonna end it here. I'm exhausted, boys and gals. Sheesh. Okay, now let's watch this video. Let me bring you up to speed. Whoa, that, that is loud. Man. Sheesh. Yo, Zan, what up, dude? Um, so I caught one that you were having trouble understanding who the Council of Eight are <laughs> and what they're about. From what I know, the Council of Eight wasn't even made up by anybody. Cyrax pretty much brought it to life when he when he brought it up. I guess it was some sort of mistake, some error, and Cyrax took it as some sort of group Council of Eight. <laughs> God, that's a wow. That was a terrible explanation. <laughs> oh, oh, God. But I think the people that know what I'm talking about will get what I said. But, God. I need to quit YouTube, but we're going to be speaking like this. Jeez. But all I'm trying to say is the Council of Eight is not even real. Until Cyrax brought it up, and now it is sort of a real thing.
Okay. Jeez, that's a bit better. Council of Eight. <laughs> I'm still. It is a group that Marty, William, Edward Boy, Jasons, and a few other people made up. It, it said Jason. It's Jasons, by the way. And shout outs to him. I've seen him in my comments. To sound badass. <laughs> They made that name up to try to basically to try to scare me. There's a Bro, think about how many channels you've made and all your band names. Think about what you name them. Bro, you are trying to sound badass. I'm pulling a blank. I wish I remembered some of his channel names. Like uh it'd be like Scar Lord Scar Lord Fantasy 598. It would be that. It would be more like that. And, uh, bro, those are the corniest names. <laughs> I, oh, uh, there's one I can't think of, but, ah. Uh. More than eight members, though. There's several people. There's, several. I don't know. There's the Council of Eight, and then there's the... The Sunny of 43, which if you're wondering what 43 is, <laughs> that's me! That it, it's you! Literally their way of marking a prime target. No, no If somebody is a 43, they're on the high end spectrum of being somebody's target. Bitch, are you dumb? Pardon me? Are you dumb? I think she's I dumb. I think she's dumb. I think she's dumb. Think are you, dumb. like, medically speaking, are you, like, like I'm not trying to be mean. Like, are you dumb? Are you? D I think she's dumb. I think she's dumb. I think she's dumb. I think is she. Do you think oh, she's, she's she's dumb. dumb. And that's what the council of eight does. They run around. They target people. Wait, isn't forty three when you get charged for some um when somebody's mentally insane they get called a forty? I guys, you let me know. I don't think that's correct. What he's saying. Let me know down below, please. They mark people one through however many um, numbers they go to. And then if you're like a, in the 40s or higher, like if you're like say 40, 41, 42, you need to know what I mean. What? Like if you're in like the 40s or higher, you're mid to this sounds high retarded. level to your targeting. I'm sorry, this sounds retarded. Depending on how you react. And because of the way that I reacted, I got marked a 43, but I'm not going off the deep end and doing super, super, just super crazy extreme. What? Just because you're not banging your mom or going to jail, which you might. You know what? I consider you worse than Chris Chan. And I know that's a bit of a hot take, but bro, I like. <laughs> He's like, well, at least I don't, like, uh, kill people, and, uh... <laughs> Bro, you're bad. You're a horror cow. And I'm starting to think that term came from you. Did horror cow come from Cyrax? Let me know. Stuff to be on the high end. The, the high end. So they mark me as a 43. Which is their way of, like I said... Making a prime target. Okay. Okay. I'm so glad I read down below. 43 is an APD code. For somebody that's either mentally deranged. Yo, I knew this is sounded too regarded. But he is. It's so funny. He says stuff with so much conviction. You like. Think. You're like. Okay. What is happening here? You start questioning yourself, but you still know he's talking out his ass. Well, like I said the council of eight are comprised of several people, and they go out of their way to target. Oh, COA is council of eight. People. And Reddit. Oh, I see. When I read it, there I was being dumb. Reddit made up the council of eight. They attack people who they deem is a worthy target. That they can manipulate, use, abuse, um, extort, and blackmail. Start throw any adjectives in the air. Go ahead. All that kind of stuff for money. Money. Ow. 
Yo, this. Is... Oh, another little fun fact for you. The other night, Music Biz Marty got caught on a Discord call shooting up. <laughs> no. <laughs> he said this in another video as well. Camera, he got caught. He's saying this again because he's noticing no one cares. He's like, oh, guys, just letting you know for a second that I know you guys don't care, but I'm going to try to make you care. So, yeah. Yeah. There's no fun fact for you. Got him. But uh, hopefully that explains who the Council of Eight is, dude. If you have any more questions, feel free to let me know. And, oh, my know. goodness. <laughs> oh, yeah, you covered everything. Jeez, that guy you're answering, you did his question justice. <sighs> oh, he has no more questions. Don't worry, you covered everything. <laughs> oh my goodness. Okay, is he just like dumb as a brick and he honestly thinks this? Or is he trying to make this digestible? to the regular person and is he trying to by doing that making him look like the better person and lying right obviously i i, I don't know it's either one of the two he just does i i <laughs> and guys like i said there is so many more videos that i'm going to be covering oh trust me this is going to be a little video but yeah guys hope you enjoy this make sure you like subscribe do all those shenanigans and i'm a dip peace 